Tina Sanchez could not be with us today. My name is Anne Marie Wright, and I am honored to be a board member of Chicago Foundation for Women and co-chair this 33rd annual luncheon. I also serve as the U.S. Chief Auditor for BMO Financial Group. I am proud to share with you my truth today. My father died when I was very young. My mother worked in social services and with two young daughters found it necessary to work a second job. After leaving her day job, my mother taught GED classes to the male inmates at Cook County Jail four nights a week for well over 10 years. One of my most vivid memories of childhood, this is way before cell phones, was that I would sit and wait for my mother to come home from work well after 9 p.m. I wanted to share my day with her, talk about school, friends, but really to tell on my sister. <laughs> Years later, I recognized the sacrifice that she made and all that she accomplished as a single parent, providing tremendous opportunities not only for my sister and I, but later for her grandchildren. My mother and Lupe are not like, unlike many women in Chicago. They do whatever they can to support their families. That's why I am so proud and passionate about the work that CFW does for women and girls in Chicago. I grew up seeing firsthand that women are resourceful, resilient, and can do anything no matter what the sacrifice. So I feel I have a personal stake in supporting Chicago Foundation for Women in its mission. Together, we work to increase the resources for the women and girls across this region and make sure and possible life-changing opportunities. Now, here is a truth to consider. One in four mothers in Cook County is a single parent. The truth is, our futures are bound together. I am just one small part of a powerful network of women and resources working to see the future of our city. My work in CFW has taken me all over the city and I've seen firsthand the impact of the investments that are made in our communities. CFW is essential to ensuring that families that live in our region can live with dignity and in the fullness of their humanity. When I give my time and money to CFW, I get impact. Over the past two years, CFW's investments have helped over 700 women, like Lupe, increase their annual earnings by $18,000 each. That means nearly 13 million additional dollars each year in women's pockets. When I give to CFW, I get leadership. CFW has invested in the growth and development of over 1,300 women leaders in Chicago with a particular focus for support of women of color. And when I give to CFW, I get justice. In the past three years, CFW has funded and been behind over 30 legislative victories, including paid sick leave in Cook County, the expansion of reproductive health care coverage for all Illinois women, and help for survivors of human trafficking. <laughs> CFW doesn't just empower, we stand in power with women and girls all around the region. We are a community of people of all gender identities united in a common cause, working to create a world where each and every one of us has the opportunity to thrive in a safe, just, and healthy community. So do you dare to join us in making our vision a reality today? If you have felt inspired by anything you've heard here today, please join me in making a gift to the Chicago Foundation for Women. To give is a daring act. I dare you to join me by making a gift in an amount that is personally significant to you. And thanks to the daring generosity of Shelley and Bert Rosenberg, every dollar that you give today, up to $150,000, will be matched. So 
On your tables, there are envelopes um, where you can fill out the information. It contains all the information you need to make a gift. And as an additional bonus, you will notice stickers in each envelope on the table. The stickers say, I dare to invest in women and girls. We invite everyone who gives a gift today of any size to wear one of these stickers with pride. I'll give you a moment to get yourselves organized. Please leave your envelopes at the center of your table. We'll pick them up at the conclusion of the event. Thank you so very much for daring to invest in women and girls.